Hello and welcome back to the EGL Astro Gaming Championship Playoffs. I am Fox and I'm joined by Draft. We're going to be casting Team Infused versus Team Resist. Yeah, well, for a little update on uh, who is actually going to be playing in Team Resist, and there's five players on the roster as well, so don't, you know, don't like quote me on who is playing. But anyway, on the roster on EGL that says that there's going to be Flex, Cod, Be Lucky, uh, Youp Hose. Not entirely sure how to pronounce that full name. Uh, Pablo Skis and Tor Toro uh, Torjo Torjo, I think. Yeah, that's that's going to be the team. Uh, that's going to be the team for Resist. Yeah, it seems as though they're a, they're a Spanish team, at least according to the chat. It's a it's a Spanish team, so I'm going to go yeah, with that. Yeah. But uh, so the pronunciations on these names probably going to be very difficult for us, uh, not native Spanish speakers, but. <laughs> But <laughs> yeah, Infused definitely. has had a pretty impressive tournament run so far, so we will just see how this Spanish team can uh, can can play against them. Any predictions for this match? Are you familiar with the Spanish team at all? No, no, uh, no way. I, uh, I think I'm gonna... going, yeah, going into this, I'm I'm exactly the same as you. I've I've no idea who was this all. But um, but obviously, you know, like in in my opinion, I have to say, I know this is kind of you know backing up the big boys here. Really, after I have to admit. But um, I'm pretty confident that Team Infuse will probably take this. You know, the like the, you know, the amount of domination that they've showed and that they've been able to take two at three O's. This could potentially be their third three O of the night. Um, you know, but we don't know. We'll just see what happens when we go into it. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure we'll learn a lot about this squad today. Uh, I'm I'm pretty sure that the uh, the player Tojor. I'm pretty sure that's actually uh, like like Tony. <laughs> so a little yeah. bit of translations here, I guess. Uh, we have you you for sit. Yufo Siri, ah, you know what? I'm not going to pretend to know how to say that, so let's call him Yufo. <laughs> uh, we got Be Lucky, and we have Flex under this, the Spanish team here. So, uh, first map's going to be Retreat Hardpoint. I think that's something you can expect, at least out of Infused here on this map, is to see Marky B and Urban as consistent as they usually have been in the past several hardpoints with their assault rifle, um, holding down uh, not, not the best positioning, I would say. We've definitely seen better positioning in terms of uh, anchoring on each hill. But uh, you'll see them drop numbers. I mean, Marky B got 49 kills, just shy of his 50 in, in one of the other matches. And then we saw that uh, that close Solar Hardpoint match. Um, we mm -hmm. saw that Marky B and Urban went on that huge streak at the end. So those are just two players that can that you can really expect to be explosive compared to the others on their team. I'm not quite sure what the issue might be that is delaying this match here. But uh, I'm hoping that they, they get started they get it started uh, quickly here. Yeah. And I mean as well, you know, something to some to obviously kind of add on as well. You know, ev every single hard point game that we've seen in Fuse play has been a you know, very very close game. Um, so you know, we could go into this one that it could be a complete whitewash. We don't know. Um, but hopefully, I'd like I want to see very very close all the way through because that's you know normally the best games to see anyway. Um, of course. Yeah. As well, we're uh, waiting for them to solve whatever issue they might be having there in the background. We're just going to run to a quick commercial break. Uh, I would imagine that the problem will be resolved shortly. But uh, it's a commercial break, guys. We'll be back as soon as possible with some more Call of Duty action. Stay tuned. Hello and welcome back to the Ast the EGL Astro Gaming Championship Playoffs. We have Team Infuse facing off against the Spanish team, and I've already uh, had trouble tried, with their name once or twice. Tried to pronounce the names, yeah. <laughs> but hopefully, we, we're forced to learn their names today, and they put on a great show, a great, great, uh, a great show here against Team Infuse. But it's Team Resist, Team Resist up against Infuse here. So I'm actually going to start off with them. Who, uh, I'm going to start off with Flex and see what he has to show for us today. Off the rip, running the ASM1, expect him to be very aggressive towards either the hill or towels right off the start. Yep, and as you can see, he's going to be pushing all the way over the bar. And as you can see, there is going to be a player here from Team Fuse. He is going to be able to take him down and literally mass kills coming in from Resist. It is only going to be Marky B left alone by himself, rocking that ball in mid-map. He's just going to be slaying up Resist and... By the looks of it, gaining control over the hill for Team Infused. 
All right, and here it is, Flex. Again, as I said, trying to be aggressive on this hill. He's going to be just behind one player, but he hears his footsteps coming. That doesn't matter, though. He's going to be shut down. Zero picks up the two-piece Marky B getting three kills, but now that's going to be four dead for Team Resist, and now we're back on board with Infuse, who has control of the hill up 20 seconds already within the match starting. Yeah, but I mean, Team Infuse definitely completely slain out Resist. I mean, at one moment in time, it was literally just all blue for Team Infuse. Um, you know, resist, but like struggling to pick up very many kills inside this hill. By the looks of it, they have actually just left it and went, you know, rotated to the next hill. So hopefully they'll be able to gain control of it. But I'm actually on with Marky B. He's coming around all the way on the flank, able to pick up a nice little two piece here. He is trying to pick up the third, who was going to go cut, but unable to pick him up. As you can see, the whole squad of Team Infuse literally picking up several kills on Team Resist. Yeah, it looks like Infuse just completely outslaying Team Resist with a combined 20 kills against Team Resist, combined 10 kills. You know, doubling their slaying column is pretty impressive, and we're seeing the score represent that as they're up about 50 seconds with Marky B sitting on the hill, completely uncontested for the past maybe 20 seconds. It's Zero and Urban are just around slaying. He's not even on the hill with the teammate, really. He's just kind of holding it down, just waiting on communication, just pre-aiming anywhere because there's no, no, there's no action. They just can't even get to him. Mm -hmm. that, like he's well yeah there's just literally there's nothing else that I can add this oh well there you go literally finally to Joe or Tony able to push inside this hill gaining a bit of control at least for resistance by the looks of it infused fighting back able to gain control yet again is gonna get full back but there you go just team infused looking insanely dominant yeah, and we're, if you're just tuning in, guys, we are on map number one of this best of five series. We have Team Resist facing off against Team Infuse, and Team Infuse has an extremely impressive lead of 70 seconds and just completely outslaying Team Resist. Urban picks up a four piece right there with the bow on the hard point. Still staying alive on his bloodthirsty. Not too much uh, competition against him on this map, it would seem, in terms of uh, dominant ARs. Everyone on Team Resist currently going negative, at least one. And it seems like they're struggling to get any any sort of pressure on the hard point. But just as I say that, we're going to see Tony and Ufo break through with two kills. But they're instantly traded. PD and Marky B filling the shoes of those two infused players that fell. Yeah, I mean, literally, you know, some some of the obviously are, you know, some of the obviously talk about well, this game's going on in the background. Um, you know, I, like I don't know what this is down to. I don't know if you know. Uh, resist are struggling because of you know the connection between team infused obviously you know being a UK based team resist being a Spanish team I don't know if there might be some connection issues so maybe when we go into the search and destroy next maybe resist might be able to take it you know very very easy off team infused and be able to completely melt them and um, I'm not entirely sure but definitely team infused this game looking like they're gonna shut this one out very very fast Right, rotation coming into Bar Hill. We're finally seeing, uh, we're finally seeing some resist get some time on the hill for the first time in maybe three hard points. Zufo and Tony, uh, the main players to get the kills on the hard point, we're going to rack up some kills. It looks like Ufo five captures to his name. That's the most out of anyone in the game. So keep that in mind as he pulls out the ASM one. Play a little bit of defense here, waiting for someone to cross into his crosshairs, but he's going to fall. That's going to be Urban, and it's really been the story all game. It's just Urban and Zero coming through these hills and just destroying people. Mm hmm. And literally, it's like Trey, Trey Zero, 25 to 10, as he was going to go on this rotation here, finally getting shut out by Flex, as he was going to be pushing inside the cell, getting taken down by Flex. But literally, by the looks of it, Resist starting to pick up quite a few kills on Team Infused, as Urban finally taking down Flex, who was inside of this hill. And by the looks of it, Resist still in, still in control of the hill, but, you know, unable to push off Team Infused, but by the looks of it, Team Infused able to push in strong. And it does look like anytime soon they will be in control of this hill. All right, there it is. Tony with the two-piece at bottom. Art is going to buy his team some more time on that hard point, trying to decrease this deficit as much as possible as Flex gets a two-piece of his own. We've got Tony on a five kill streak, looking to make it ten. Is two or looking to make it seven? As two players come up the stairs, they have a flex and be lucky are able to shut them down without him even having to bat an eyelash. But now here comes the challenge. He's able to fall just before Tony even has to engage. Another two kills in a row. No, Marky B shuts him down. Yeah, literally, you know, some you know, some obviously odd and some to kind of you know bring to the table here. I really like right at the start of this game, it did look like Team Infused were going to completely dominate uh, Resist. And, you know, it still is definitely looking that way. But, I mean, Resist, you know, from that one hill, racking on quite a few points indeed. 
Um, you know, obviously just nibbling away the you know the little bit of lead that uh, well the little bit a lot of lead that um, that team infused had. Uh, but still, they need to do a lot of work if they want to bring themselves back into this game. All right, we're seeing flex coming out. Oh, Tows here Tr picked up one kill, but he was instantly traded by Petey. Let's go ahead and hop on board with Be Lucky. But just as I do that, he's gonna fall. And it seems that every time I try to switch to one of these Spanish players, they're dropping to Urban, who comes through with the three piece on his streak, holding the hard point, waiting for the spawn. That's Be Lucky that gets the first initial kill. Let's see if they can continue to take out the rest of the team. Petey falls off of the hard point as well. Here comes Tony, drop shotting, trying to turn on him, but Urban finishes the job. And now we're seeing the scrap time go in favor of Team Resist as the new hard point on Turtle comes out. Yeah, and by the looks of it as well, just nobody, well, it does look like Team Infused are going to be the first ones there. I'm going to be on with Urban. He is going to be pushing that straight through cut. Marky B able to pick up that kill on Tony. As Urban able to take down Epo off that head glitch there by a back tree. He's just going to be lying down inside of this hill. Try to regen a bit of health. And he's just going to be waiting for the opposition to push in. As by the looks of it, the whole squad of Resist trying to push in for a team push. But Team Infuse shutting them out swiftly, not letting a single player push in anywhere near this hill. Now in the first rotation, we saw pretty much all of this hill go to Team Infused, and, and Marky B really had very few, uh, very few conflicts and confrontations on the hill. He was just able to sit there behind this rock that Urban is actually on right now, while uh, Urban and Zero just slayed around around Art and Towels. No one really ever got the chance to come to Marky B until like the last 20 seconds of the hard point. And it looks like that's the story here, but with Urban taking the position. Uh, so the scrap time is actually going to go in favor of Team Resist as the rotation comes in. Be lucky and you far hoping to hit the rotation and and win it even though infuse are getting the initial time yeah i mean you know by the looks of it as well it is probably going to be all over for resist on this hill i'm pretty confident that team infuse can probably take it on this hill if they hold it down for the full maximum amount of time by the looks of it that's definitely what they're trying to do they're trying to shut this game out as fast as possible going on with trey he is going to be going in for that stomp marky b is going to be able to pick up a nice little two-piece Going on with Jay trying to push out the back, trying to pick up Tony there. Tony able to pick up a nice little two piece. Urban fighting back, able to get two players from oh, a team no. resist. Back and forth kills coming in. Yeah, realistically at this point it's over. Uh, even with resist getting those, those K spawns right there, they were just not able yeah. to come through and take the hill. They were forced way out uh, over to, to pool side and art side. And still, they're, they're losing all these gunfights. You see. Zero picking up that two piece and Flex is really the only one left alive to answer to it, but he's shut down by Urban and it's just infused winning in dominating fashion. They were able to take and, and hold the spawns with very few issues. I mean, on every hill it was just extremely one sided from the very beginning. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, like very first side going all the way it wasn't even it was just a start of the first um start of the final hill on first rotation of fact. Uh Trey was actually 25 kills and 18 deaths. I think it was 18, might have been 16, not entirely sure. But 25 kills was named, and it wasn't even at the end of the first rotation. So mass amount of slain power coming in from him and the whole squad of Team Infused. Guys, we are going to have a quick commercial break. We're going to wait to go over to Rise's host. Don't go anywhere, and we'll see you guys in a few minutes.